NOAH TODAY ON THE HURRICANE SEASON, WHICH OFFICIALLY STARTS JUNE 1ST. SAMMY SQUIRES HAS THE LATEST ON THAT. SAMMY. Thanks, Steve. Yeah, we have the newest update that was released earlier this morning. Now, this is the NOAA forecast for the upcoming hurricane season. What they are forecasting is 13 to 19 named storms, 6 to 10 of those to become hurricanes, and then 3 to 5 of those to become major hurricanes. Where does this stack up? Well, it is actually going to be an above average forecast. So if we do see this many named storms. Now, last year we did see 18 named storms, 11 hurricanes, and five of those to become major hurricanes. Uh, so that was also an above average forecast and what we actually received as well. So historically, they are pretty good at getting these forecasts right. Where does this compare to other forecasts? Well, CSU has predicted 17 named storms, nine of those to become hurricanes, and four of those to become major hurricanes. So a very similar forecast. What is going into these forecast elements. Well, there are multiple diff different factors that go into the forecast. One being the ENSO conditions, which we are transitioning into a neutral phase. So that means no El Nino or La Nina. Also, Tropical waves from the West African monsoon, they are predicting higher activity from this, which means more waves coming off of Africa and thus more storms. And then also ocean temperatures, when we have these warm ocean temperatures, it acts as fuel for these storms and we get more storm activity. And then also weak wind shear is in the forecast, which means weaker winds that allow for these storms to develop and really take their shape and hold on to that. So those are some of the different things that are going into the forecast when Noah is actually deciding on these different forecast elements. Yeah. Okay. Here's the question I have for all of you. Okay. Are you nervous about going into this hurricane season at all? Oh, uh, that, I mean, nervous isn't the right word. But I, if you're prepared, you're ready, you have yeah. your hurricane kit, you know, if you're in an evacuation area, if you know where you're going to go, if you have to evacuate, if you're forced to, you shouldn't be nervous at all. You should, you're well prepared, you're ready to go. Um, do I think there's a higher chance that we may see a storm this year? Uh, I'm a little edgy about the Bermuda High. It's so far south, it's been sitting south, and very similar to what we saw in 2004, the storms come in. The can't turn toward the Carolinas right. and they're driven into Florida. So that's something that we'll have to watch. Now, it is still May yes. and that comes into play in late August and September. Yeah. So yeah. it's a long way out and hopefully that Bermuda High will get more over Bermuda and away from us. All and, right. and what's interesting, Todd, I didn't want to interrupt go, go, go you here, ahead, but what's interesting because she brought up the warmer than normal ocean temperatures. There's a large part of the Atlantic mm -hmm. where the ocean temperatures are actually below normal now. So we're going to have to see how that plays in anything. You get into the MDR region, the whole thing is below normal. Parts of the Caribbean are just slightly at normal. It's the yes. Gulf. The Gulf is what's pretty warm, so we would have to watch the enclosed development. But that MDR is chilly right now, so we'll okay. see. Okay, you coming from Philly and being here, this has got to be something that you have looked forward to oh, yeah. and covering something like this. Yeah, we, we even up there, we track hurricane. I mean, remember, one of the worst... Uh, storms to ever hit the United States was Sandy. That was my own backyard. So uh, we're no st up there. We're no strangers to the, even though you guys, well, we get hit more down, down here, here, but we would get it up there too. And we always say it only takes one storm. Yes, that is yep. right. Milton, let's, let's go mm -hmm. with that one. Yep. All right. Thank you guys for all of us joining us here. Now join us for our hurricane preparedness forum on the Treasure Coast. It's next Thursday afternoon at four at the Indian River State College Massey Campus in Fort Pierce. You can reserve a seat on our website, WPTV.com.